can see there's stuff all over the road. <clears throat> well, it's poo. And that's it. That's where they ran them out all day. But there's poo all over the road because they've been running them cattle right down the road. That's how they do things. I wouldn't be biking out here. People driving down this road going 100 miles an hour. Well, beautiful valley. This is a long road. It's wilderness up there, buddy. That's all there is to say about it. Just pure wilderness. Holy smokes, we got a traffic jam. Oh, summer just started. Huh, you know what that means? Could be a cop out here. Gonna have to watch out. Thanks for watching. One owner car guy and calving season is here and Breeder is chasing him away. She started barking and buddy they all started bolting. They were all calm before that. They're everywhere. Cattle, cattle everywhere. One owner car guy, one owner cow, blah, blah, blah. one owner cow guy. You tell him, Breeder. I have a bullhorn. And you go, Man, they're moving back. Awesome, I'm cool. Like, what the hell? There's something wrong with that cow. Look at this one. I don't know if you see it. It's like, my God. Well, and there is so many cows out there. Just as far as you can see. Beautiful little farm down in that nook. Breeder, don't you be trying to get out of that car. What are you doing? She's a little... Actually, she's a little car sick. Do car sick. I left the windows down. I forgot about you jumping out. Okay, flashers. Thanks for watching. Have a great day or night. Whatever it is. Wherever you are. My name's Nathan. Taking pictures of cows. Well, that's my game today. We'll see ya! Beautiful, just straight up wilderness up there. It's got some tall gears in this bad boy. I think the stinking thing is, it's got low gears too. There's six of them. Six automatic gears. That did wonders for my gas mileage right there. This back road, it always does wonders for my gas mileage. I'll bet you I take this Mustang from getting 32 miles a gallon down to getting about 26, 24. And that's just in 90 miles of driving. take a video of this town. This is Jackson. Got somebody calling me. I don't know who they are. So I'm not going to answer right now. I'm actually totally amazed at rain right here. But we are traveling through Montana. Jackson is not a big town. Which is kind of why I wanted to show this. Just a cool little town on the Lewis and Clark Trail type deal. Now, 
low tier. It is Jackson Hot Springs. And they don't really call it Jackson Hot Springs, but it is Jackson Hot Springs. Look at them old buildings. Old. Right across from the new. Old firehouse. Mechanic shop. And if you blinked, there's a schoolhouse. Jackson School, the Jackson Jaguars. All 15 of them go there. Heck, I don't even know if there's that many. Okay, that was Jackson. <laughs> Next up, Wisdom. Which ain't much more of a town. It is absolutely beautiful out here, though. No one's ever around. There ain't nothing here. Well, there's a little teeny cemetery. People just dying to get in there, I tell you. They're dying to get in there. So, that is the deal. Stuck behind a cattle truck. And I just wanted to show up over this here hill. I know right when it comes out over to this edge, it's just beautiful out there. Try to zoom in. Stockgambles.com. I want to show you around this, right around the bend. Just, it's just more Big Valley, I guess. That would be much more than what I've been showing you already. Guy.com. This is a little town called Wisdom. And by a little town, I mean a little town. Not much at all here in Wisdom. Besides the speed trap. It's like the revenue for the whole municipality. Municipality? I think that's a word. Okay, well, we are in Wisdom. And we are basically out of Wisdom. This is the main drag. I think there's about half a dozen, dozen businesses down there. And that's that. Well, I get, like, just a bar here. So I'm going to go ahead and check it out. Thanks for watching. Okay, I'm gonna get just a little bit of this. You should see this pass on the in the snow. It's crazy. But this pass is quite curvy and fun <laughs> in the summer, as long as you're careful. I've got flat tires in here quite a few times before. And the snow gets as high as the second red marker. And there is little steppy steps here to walk you right off the road, buddy. And by walk you right off the road, I mean your car will go right off the road and into the ditch. Seriously, though. What more fun could a guy have on a Friday afternoon? I mean, really. Four-wheel disc on a Mustang. Rental car. <laughs> and my fourth pass, you have no clue how good this car is broken in now. No clue. Next guy gets this car, they say it's gonna like be like, what? Who's driving this, Grandpa Jones? Seriously, man, it's got some power band to it too. 
well, one owner car guy. It ain't this one. <laughs> I think our biker's gonna slow us down here. He sure is. to the, all them are, there's ski slopes all over up there. This is a beautiful area. Lost Trail Hot Springs, that's what that is. Hot Springs on the bottom, skiing on the top. That's what she said. Well, that's pretty much out of the pass. I'm loving this manual push button. Tranny. Haven't used it as much as I should have, maybe. Well, thanks for watching. We'll talk to you.